Using the robot, we can actually uh, recognize whether the human wants to interact with the robot or, or whether the human feels safe or comfortable or not. Um, and then based on that judgment, uh, in the future, we can have the robot uh, works very uh, more naturally and more smoothly with human uh, and also respect the human's preferences. In the future, imagine you go to a superstore, uh, you want to find something and, and the blimp can actually interact with you and actually guide you uh, to the place where you, uh, you need to find the item. We think the blimp is a very good platform for it because, uh, you know, because of the long flight time and because of the safeness and because of the comfortness when it actually interacts with you. Um, so that's why we are developing this blimp to fill the gap uh, between you know, flying robot and, and, human, uh, and, and human. So how flying robot and human can actually uh, work well with each other.